ಎಲ್ಲರಿಗೂ ನಮಸ್ಕಾರ ಇಸ್ಕಾನ್ ಸೊಸೈಟಿ ಮತ್ತು ಅಕ್ಷಯ ಪಾತ್ರ ಫೌಂಡೇಶನ್ ಅಧ್ಯಕ್ಷ ಪೂಜ್ಯ ಶ್ರೀ ಮಧು ಪಂಡಿತ್ ದಾಸ ಮೈಸೂರಿನ ಎಮ್ ಎಲ್ ಎ ಕೃಷ್ಣರಾಜ್ ಕಾಂಟಿಸ್ ಕಾನ್ಸ್ಟಿಟ್ಯೂನ್ಸಿಯಿಂದ ಎಮ್ ಎಲ್ ಎಂ ಕೆ ಶಿವಶೇಖರ್ ಅವರಿಗೆ ಮತ್ತು ಮೈಸೂರಿನ ಎಮ್ ಎಲ್ ಸಿ ಜಿ ಮಧುಸೂದನ್ ಅವರು ಮತ್ತು ವೇದಿಕೆ ಮೇಲೆ ಉಪಸ್ಥಿತ ಎಲ್ಲ ಗಣ್ಯರು ಮೊದಲೇದಾಗಿ ಎಲ್ಲರಿಗೂ ಹೊಸ ವರ್ಷದ ಆರ್ಥಿಕ ಶುಭಾಶಯಗಳು ವೆರಿ ಗುಡ್ ವೆರಿ ನ್ಯೂ ಇಯರ್ ವೆರಿ ಹ್ಯಾಪಿ ನ್ಯೂ ಇಯರ್ ಟು ಆಲ್ ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ವೆರಿ ಗುಡ್ ಈವ್ನಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಆಲ್ ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಮೈ ಆನ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಪ್ರಿವಿಲೇಜ್ ಟು ಇನಾಗ್ರೇಟ್ ಶ್ರೀ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಬಲರಾಮ ರಥ ಯಾತ್ರ ವಿಚ್ ವಾಸ್ ಇನಿಷಿಯೇಟೆಡ್ ಬೈ ಹಿಸ್ ಡಿವೈನ್ ಗ್ರೇಸ್ ಎ ಸಿ ಭಕ್ತಿ ವೇದಾಂತ ಸ್ವಾಮಿ ಫೌಪ್ರದ ಫೌಂಡರ್ ಆಫ್ ಇಸ್ ಕಾನ್ ಎಸ್ ಅ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಹಿಸ್ ಮೂವ್ಮೆಂಟ್ ಟು ಎಜುಕೇಟ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ bring a uh, part of the hindu world to the rest of the world the rath yatra which was started by his divine grace has become famous all over the world and its importance in bringing the core temple to the people is immense it is also thus a symbol of mysore's cultural and spiritual heritage that the rath yatra has chosen to come to his great city i once again thank the international society for krishna consciousness for giving me the honor of inaugurating the festival ISKCON has played a very significant role in bringing the spiritual and philosoph- philosophical Hindu texts into the Western limelight. Its ideology and discipline has reached all corners of the globe and has advanced thought and perception of Hinduism immensely. Mysore has had a long association with ISKCON. Shri Lai Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati, who was the spiritual guru to his divine grace, A.C. Bhakti Vedanta Swami Prabhupada, came to Mysore during the illustrious reign of His Highness, Sir Shri Krishna Ajavadeva IV. He came to Mysore on 17th June 1932 on invitation from the Maharaja. Shri Krishna Ajavadeva IV was a keen philosopher and well acquainted with both Eastern and Western philosophy. It is with this interest that the Maharaja insisted that, insisted that Shri Lai Bhakti, Shri Lai Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati be invited to share his intellect with Uh, with us in Mysore. Srila Bhakti Siddhanta had mastered the means of explaining our rich spirituality and ve- philosophy in Western terms. Srila Bhakti Siddhanta Swami, while in Mysore as a state guest, made many speeches and public meetings arranged by the Maharaja. He pointed out that Mysore lay in between two opposing thoughts of Hinduism, Advaita and Dvaita. Shringeri Mutt in the West and the Mulgadal Mutt in the East, who all both preached the opposing thoughts. Mysore being at the center of these two disciplines was fitting for Sri Lai Saraswati Thakur to preach his middle path in between dualism and monism, giving proof that Mysore has always been the place where all thought, ideas, belief and philosophy can come together and live in harmony. In remembrance of his visit to Mysore, uh, Sri Krishna Jodhir IV um, constructed a community hall Uh, known as the Chaitanya Mahaprabhu Community Hall as a mark of respect and in remembrance of his, his Divine Grace's visit here. And uh, with that, I'd like to end my speech and I wish everyone the choicest blessings and a very happy new year once again and uh, all, all the very best for the Ratu Atra and myself. Thank you very much.